Good morning. Happy Wednesday, everyone. So a lot going on when we look at the cloud cover out early this morning, your Wednesday morning, shaping up to be a little bit on the cloudy side today, but a bit of sunshine breaking through from time to time as well. Combination of things going on, some fog where there isn't higher level clouds as well. You can see it building up just over the early morning hours in areas like Lane County making its way further to the south. So fog in a lot of the typical areas, same places we saw yesterday, similar amount of cloud cover. Temperatures should be very similar to yesterday as well. It's what's on the way that we're really looking out for. So for the time being, high pressure pretty well in control. That's going to keep this ridge up over our area, keeping us warm, keeping us sunny, keeping us dry, or at least bringing some sunshine. It's not the best built up ridge, and because of that, some cloud cover making its way through from time to time. Saw that yesterday, but uh, yeah, as we go a little bit later into the week, we've got a whole nother system on the way, and that's going to approach as we get into Thursday night and Friday. Could bring some light rain, mainly out on the coast and a little further to the north. Possibility of some light showers, but we'll call it a slight chance for now in areas like Jackson County, Josephine County. Also some slightly cooler temperatures getting closer and closer to our averages. Usually we're in the mid 50s, for example, yesterday for a lot of areas in Jackson County, for example, we were in the upper 60s. So yeah, a little warmer than average. And on top of all of that, because we haven't had a lot of change in our forecast has been very stable. That air stagnation advisory is sticking around, but hopefully getting closer to Thursday and Friday we will clear that out. Here's your pinpoint forecast. It'll give us a little of a bit of a hint of what to expect over the next 48 hours. Cloud cover out off of the coast. The occasional clouds rolling through should be another nice sunrise sunset as the day goes on. Let's keep on going into Thursday. That's what you're looking at here. Some clouds come through, but then clear out as we get into Thursday morning. Just a bit, a little bit of sunshine, a little bit of cloud cover, about a 50 50 split, and then we go later Thursday into Friday. There's the front. Now most of this is staying, as you can see, out towards the coast, out towards the north, but that does bring some good shower activity something we haven't seen for a few weeks now, even some potential for areas like Jackson County and then east of the Cascades, Northern California, probably staying dry. That is until about Monday. We have another system on the way. You'll see that in the seven day forecast. Otherwise, for today, mostly cloudy, some areas of fog, temperatures in the 50s and 60s on the coast and the West Valley is very similar to yesterday. A little cool to start out, but not quite cold, partly cloudy with some fog early temperatures topping out in the mid to upper 60s and east of the Cascades temperatures also getting into the 60s for some areas, other areas in the 50s after a cool morning, mostly sunny to partly cloudy, and then we'll call it mostly cloudy later tonight. Here's your seven day forecast for the Rogue Valley. You can see that chance of showers mainly late Thursday into early Friday that we see that potential out there cools us down just a bit as we go into Friday and Saturday More sunshine for Saturday and then Sunday, Monday and Tuesday bringing some slight chances of showers this is looking like that chance is starting to pick up towards Tuesday, so we'll call it showers for the Klamath Basin. You're a little further to the east, so likely staying dry for the most part as we go over the next seven days, but there is that potential Monday and Tuesday. Northern California also a lot like what we see east of the Cascades, a little bit of a cool down towards Friday and Saturday, and then we're seeing at least a chance of showers on Tuesday and for the coast. This is where most of that shower activity is going to be Thursday into Friday, and then more showers towards Monday and Tuesday.